When you log into your account, you'll be greeted with your dashboard. Here in the middle, you'll see all the recent activity on your campaigns. For example, when someone leaves feedback or downloads one of your promos. On the right hand side, you have some information about the billing of your account and widgets to monitor the bandwidth and storage space you've used. Once you've had a look around, the next thing to do is go to the settings page and make sure you have everything configured how you want it. At the top, you'll see various tabs. I'll run through each of those now and explain some of the important options. On the account tab, you can change your billing details and choose which subscription plan you're on. On the users tab, you can add additional users to the account who can then use their own email address and password to log in. If you want, you can also limit which parts of the account they can access. For example, they might only be able to pay the bills or only be able to edit the look of your promos. Check out the relevant FAQ article for more information about the different types of user. On the U tab, you'll find some basic settings relevant to your user account. For example, you can decide whether email replies to the promos you send come to the main account email address or to your own user email address. On the Premier plan and above, you can additionally add further email addresses here which you can then choose to send promos from. On the Templates tab, you can design how the invitations, emails and promos sent from your FatDrop account look. We very much recommend customising these with your own logo or branding as it gives your promos a more professional feel. For more info on that, check out our template design video. On the Audio tab, you'll find some settings regarding the tracks you upload. We recommend that you read the descriptions of the two types of watermarker and choose the one which works best for you. For more information or help on understanding these, feel free to get in touch with us. On the Campaigns tab, you'll find some settings regarding the promos you send. For example, what name your promo emails will appear to come from and which address your recipient's replies will go to. Note that if you choose to use custom email settings in the U tab, then that will override the settings here. In the Messages tab, you will find any messages from us regarding your account, and if you want to get in touch with us for whatever reason, then you can do so here. During office hours, there will also be a live chat icon in the bottom right which you can use to speak to us in real time. If you have any questions at all about the service, then don't hesitate to get in touch, and one of our support team will be happy to help. Once you've got your settings configured, it's time to design your templates and then go to the mailing list page and start adding your contacts. See the relevant videos for more help on that.